<laughs> Let's play! Whoa! Hey there, ladies and gentlemen, you all may call me Pharaoh, and welcome back to Let's Play I, The Somnium Files. The last time we left off, we investigated Sunfish Pocket and the Akumi Shrine to look for Renju, and I totally forgot that Mama from Marble told us to meet her up later on because there's somebody associated with Ren that will be dropping by later to go ahead and give us more information. But when we went there, the game turned to Call of Duty. And there was like a whole squad of people trying to kill me, but using porn and calculations, we came out safe. So we're back at our house because we need we need to be safe here. So uh, we have Iris with us, and uh, well, I'm going to take a look at things before we talk to her, like I always do. Once again, I'm not really sure if anything funny is going to happen here because we just got shot at like crazy. But, you know, I guess it never hurts to double check on, on stuff. Because sometimes, I don't know, you get like a little bit of different lore. But somehow I'm thinking that we're not going to this time around. But as I said, I'm just uh, going through this really quick. It goes by fast, so... I love how I keep explaining this after, what, 30-something episodes in here? Force of habit. Guys, I, I don't know if I'll ever change that. Alright. So, Iris is sitting down. About the unidentified attackers. Iris, those guys who tried to kidnap you, do you have any idea who they were? After a long silence, Iris spoke. There's a reason I asked you to go on a date so many times. I wanted you to protect me. I wanted a bodyguard. But I thought that if I told you the truth, you wouldn't believe me. That's why I didn't tell you. But now, I'll come clean. My life is being threatened by a secret society. They're called the Nizet Laws. A group under the control of the Wajet system. Their ultimate goal is to complete X00639. I discovered them and what they were up to, and now... What the hell did I just hear? What? Date, please help me! They're going to kill me! Wait, wait. Slow down. You're gonna need to hold on really quick. So you got a secret society called the what now? They're called the Nizet Laws. Nizet Laws? And they're under the control of the Waja system, the same thing about core AI programming. And they're gonna try completing that. X00639. Do I have to remember that? Oh man, okay, hold on. So, first off, about Nizet Laws. It's spelled N-A-I-X-A-T-L-O-Z. Sometimes they just call themselves the Nyes. They're deeply connected to the Wajet system. Their organization is everywhere. International politics, business leaders, all operating in secret. Okay, man. Okay, there's some conspiracy level crap going on here. What about the relationship to the Wajet system? Well, you know about the Wajet system, right? It's the core of artificial intelligence. Do you know where it came from? It was developed by the American tech conglomerate Elgorg, but no specifics have been revealed. Basically, the Wajet system artificial intelligence is from outer space. It was transmitted to Earth in binary as radio waves. They were caught by the space dev team at Elgorg, and when they decoded it, they found that it was a truly incredible source code. That's the code they used to create the Wajet system. Is this true, Iva? It is patently ridiculous. So it's all fake? What about the X00639? In geosynchronous orbit around the equator, longitude 100 degrees east, there's a satellite. It's about 150 feet long, quite big for a satellite. True. Most satellites are between 5 and 10 feet long. The International Space Station is roughly 330 feet long. So this satellite she is describing is about half as big. It's always in the same place. And there's no doubt that it's man-made. But by who? And when it was launched, 
No one knows. Also true. The first to discover this satellite was a space advocacy group in Japan. It was on the news for a short while. No one could identify it precisely. Most people thought it was some secret U.S. military satellite and that was it. But that's not the truth. X00639 is a super-powered radio transmitter. Radio? Transmitter? But it's not complete. It's still being built. And that's what they're trying to do. That's what Wajet wants them to do. So what the hell are they gonna do with a big-ass radio transmitter? So, to summarize Iris' story, the Wajet system AI was built by decoding radio waves sent from outer space. A secret society called Nidalaz, or Nyes, I can't, I can't even pronounce it anymore, uh, knows the secret of the Wajet system and obeys its will. Their ultimate goal is to complete the radio transmitter satellite X00639. You know, I was kidding when I mentioned that this game is going to delve into, like, freaking, like, UFOs and whatever, but it sure as hell is looking like it now. And you know, just a quick question, or maybe a quick observation, about our controls here. I know, like, this is usually X'd out or faded away because that's the map button. What the hell are these two? I'm sure they were always here, like, this entire time I was playing the game. I guess I just never really thought about it, or maybe I have used these and I just can't remember. I think I'm, I'm, I'm thinking about this too much. So, why do the members of Nizet Laws follow Wajet? Nizet and Wajet have a mutually beneficial relationship. Wajet can control stock prices. Nizet benefits from that. In return, Nizet helps Wajet's ultimate goal. That's why Nizes and militaries and corporations all over the world. To help build X00639. Sure. Um, and why are they building the satellite again? Or a transceiver? I managed to learn that too. They're building X00639 so they can transmit their own data to a planet far away. If they contact a sentient species, then the process will repeat itself again. That species will decode the signal create an AI, then builds a radio transmitter. Because they're an AI, they can create copies of themselves for transmission. Doing this over and over means that Wajet will eventually spread across the universe. And after that? After that? Yeah. After they're spread all over space, what do they do next? I don't know. You don't know? Well, why do humans have children? It's the same thing. Wajet is alive. They want to spread across the universe. That's their destiny. You know, I'm not sure if I can believe or even follow all that's happening right here. But this doesn't surprise me. You know what? Why do they want... I can't even see what it says. Why do they want to keep... Why does Wajit want to keep Nyes a secret? Let's say that one day Wajet shows up on your computer screen. Hi guys, nice to meet you. Want to help us out? Do you really think humans would help? Most people would probably think their PC has a virus or something. Or they'd panic and try to remove them. I don't know what would happen. I'm sure Wajet made their own predictions. And they thought it was best to control certain parts of humanity from behind the scenes. But they needed some kind of direct influence. They can't build a satellite by themselves, right? That's why they created Nizet Laws. I, I guess that makes sense. All right, I get it. You do? Not really, but she doesn't need to know that. <sighs> but listening to your explanation, Nyes doesn't sound like a bad organization. No, that's not true. Think of how much money and resources are going to Nyes. Think of how many people are suffering in poverty and all the wars happening across the planet and human trafficking and slavery. Nyes has the power and resources to put an end to all of that. But they don't. They only care about themselves. And they'll do anything to protect their own interests. They'll kill if they have to. Which is why I'm being targeted. Because I found out their secret. Yeah, but you're... You're an idol. And you stream. 
How did you come across this information then? Well, I can't say yet. But it's true. Believe me. Nice is dangerous. You have to understand, Date. You... you saw my dead body. Yeah, but what does that have to do with... Nyes? What is this? Do you think that you were killed by Nyes in the parallel world? Yes, I think so. So what about So, then? The, oh, maybe he's a member of Nyes. But I think that's me believing it. Let's see if all this is even true. I, I am so... I don't know. You're the only person I can trust. Please, don't leave me. You have to protect me. I feel like I don't even have a choice here. I mean, it's so absurd, but she's never been like this before. Like, why would she lie? I don't think she would be joking like this. I guess we think. I heard the story is... Well, under normal circumstances, I wouldn't believe a word of it. But it is true that she was almost kidnapped by some mysterious group. And it's true that I saw her dead body in the cold storage warehouse. And if that happened in a parallel world... Date, you can't tell me that you actually believe this. Aiba, you use the one jet system too, right? So what if I do? Do you suspect me, Date? Do you think I'm an agent of Nye's? Fine. This can be solved easily. Why not look into her mind? Then you will discover if her story is true or not. A sink. Of course. I... I guess? I don't know what else to do here. Um... This is just insane, but then... Is that safe to do? Because we're still using Wadget technology, yeah? I mean, I don't want to freaking... Suspect Aiba, but... I don't know. With Iris in the passenger seat, I headed back to Abyss. But really, I didn't I didn't want to take her there. Because boss would be waiting. The men who attacked us at Golden Yokocho were waiting for us. That means they knew we were coming. Why would that be? Someone tipped them off. Or who could have? Someone who knew we were going to Marvel. That's right. No. Shoot. I did tell her we were going there, weren't weren't we? Or didn't we? And that also kind of explains what the hell she did to so in the one path. What the hell? Impossible. Hmm? Iba, can you contact Pewter? I want to ask him something. Understood. <laughs> Oh, Dante, do you need something? Dude, where the hell is boss? And actually, hold on real quick. I'm going to take a look around and stuff. Dangan? Ronpo. Oop, poop, 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 poop. Oh, that's great. That's why, that's why I look for these little Easter eggs, guys. The gear pusher. It's a gear shifter. It's kind of a funny word, word name for it. A gear pusher. There's a soaking wet merman in the back seat. What? I'm just kidding. Don't joke around at a time like this. You're gonna make me aggro. Oh what? well, that that just made you not threatening whatsoever when you say that. Ah, uh, make you aggro. Um, Date, have you got anything weird in here? Weird. Yeah, in these plastic baggies. But that's flour. Oh, who said they were gonna put plastic flower? Who's gonna put flour and plastic baggies in here? Was it Mizuki? I can't remember now. Or no, was it Aiba? It was, ugh, never mind. Or maybe it really is. <laughs> uh oh, Date, you doing some nose candy, buddy? Some booger sugar? Anyway, um, where are you? Where are you? I'm out drinking in Shinjuku. I was actually thinking of heading over to Golden Yokocho, but 
I heard something about a shootout, so the cops have it sealed off. Maybe a shootout between gangs or something? The world has become a dangerous place. Yeah, that's exactly what happened. Dude, do you happen to know there's a sink machine outside of Abyss by chance? Pewter, I need to know something. Does a sink machine exist outside of Abyss? If it does, I won't have to go to Abyss. I just can go I can just go there and sink with Iris. I thought Pewter might know, but there's only one sink machine in the entire world, and it's with us in Abyss. For now, anyway. For now. The Chiba Police Department was working on a prototype. But it was stolen six years ago. Stolen? Yes. It was being transported when it was attacked and then stolen by an armed group of men. Whoa, 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 whoa. Hold on really quick. You said how long ago was this? Six years ago. Is that something? Does it all tie together here? I don't know. The culprit is still on the loose. The device was never recovered either. Iba, were you aware of this? No. This is new information. I was not even aware there was a prototype. Hmm. And finally, do you have to know our bosses? That the wrong thing. Here we go. Pewter, where's boss right now? Not sure. I don't think she's at Abyss anymore. Maybe she went home? Is that something we want to take a chance at, though? Once again... I'm still feeling iffy, but it's all summarized for me. Option keep appearing, but you know what? Screw it. So, neither you or boss are at Abyss right now? No. Good. I can't- I can take Iris there without a problem. Thanks, Pewter. See you later. Sure thing. That's assuming she's not there. But I don't know about that. Dante, where are we going? Inside your dreams. What? I'm gonna sync with you to determine if what you were telling me is true. And if it is true, I'll fulfill your wish. My wish? You don't remember? To become your bodyguard. Is that all right? Yes, of course! I thought you saw him about playing Shuffle Forge, but okay. That's fine. Um... Man, the story just got really weird. I was not expecting any of this, for sure. But then again, it is... Never mind. Well, just like Pewter said, Boss wasn't there. I but knew exactly how to use the device. I followed her directions to the control console and prepared the machine quickly. But quick question, who's gonna take us out there when we need to? This time, I will be remotely operating the sink. Roger that. Are you ready? Yes. The time limit is six minutes, as always. I know. Alright. Let us begin. This seems dangerous as hell. I mean, we're relying on Iba and the remote feature to pull us out when need be. But you know what? I, I, I guess we can assume things will be a goal, will go okay. Oh man, this story though. Oh my God! Wait, is this Shovel Forge? Oh hell yeah! All right. It is uh, difficult to move like this. Why do you look like that? I went with a simpler look today. I figured this world couldn't handle my full resolution. Guess that's fine then. You can quit if you want, you know. Never. I will never give up! You don't have to take it that far. In any case, it seems that we've finally arrived. Is this world made of jelly cubes? This is Shovel Forge. Shovel Forge? I don't see any shovels. Or forges. Iris said that she was focused on streaming this game lately. What's that got to do with forges? Forget about the forges and listen! This Somnium is the world of Shovel Forge. A sandbox game in which you make and move cubes to create structures on a map. I'm not playing this game. On the contrary, you already are. Oh, come on, I don't want to play. Accept the reality, Date. You have no choice. Good evening, good morning, and hello. It's Tessa, also known as Asen. You bet. I'm going to be playing Shovel Forge today. Let's dive right in. Iris's Let's Play has begun. 
Help me, Date. You have to help me. It's nice. They're coming. Find me, Date. Oh, a pickaxe. Lucky. What was that all about? It appears that this Somnium will not be easy like the other ones. I didn't think the other ones were all that easy. Are you ready? Let us begin. Oh yeah, okay, the other one is Skip. Sorry, I, I was just taking a look at those controls again. So they were always there, I just, uh, wasn't really thinking about it. So I had to skip one. What the hell's the one on the right, though? So I'm a little worried that they say this one may not be as easy as the others. I'm like, oh man, I was with Date there. The other ones weren't that easy. I failed. I mean, once I figured out what I need to do, they were easy, but it's been a little while since I did, a, did something at one shot. Oh man, I wonder if there's gonna be any breaks in here too. Well, sinking in the main. One? Uh oh. Release Iris. Iris has been captured. Free her and support her. I like the little Iris cheat, like. And the music here though, okay. So we have a pickaxe. I assume we need to pick this up. Look like a pickaxe, but that's what Iris identified it as. Well, let's pick it up. This is a pretty avant garde pickaxe, perhaps designed with glow sticks in mind. Silver Gate, let's dig it up like this. This is actually kind of fun. Easy there, we've still got a job to do. That pickaxe was dropped by someone being attacked by Nice. Be careful, Date. Nice might be after you, too. Did you get that? I'll be the one being attacked. Either way, all we have to do is listen to Iris and do what she says. But which Iris? There appears to be two. I guess both for now. I think we'll find something if we dig there. Let's check it out! It is a door, or perhaps a gate. Everything looks like a block of tofu to me. This must be where we use the pickaxe. All right, just don't be too hasty. Okay, well that makes sense, but I'm curious to check out this other gate. And the monitor, yeah, let's check out the, uh, this first gate. Maybe there's something behind it. It's blocked, but it must be the outermost gate. I don't see why we want to investigate it. We will get a timey for it, but still, let's just dig. Understood. I suppose we can't dig here. Seems like it. All right, never mind. I didn't realize it was different material. Oh boy. This is definitely a pretty damn awesome Somnium just from aesthetics alone. Door or gate? It is closed. Let's just go ahead and dig it up. Go, Iba! Alright! Here I go! Oh, God. I did it! I got a rare material! Ooh! I knew today would be special! This is kind of fun, isn't it, Iba? Are we meant to do this the whole time? Uh, this is tiring. The gate's open. Let's go. Roger. I, I lost for words right now. This is a new area. And we cannot return to the previous one. Hmm, where else can I dig? We gotta find something to dig up. Am I meant to dig everywhere? Probably. Oh, there is a break. Oh man. Okay. I don't know what the hell that's gonna do. So we gotta make something. I can't go back there. There's a crafting table. I guess that's what we're supposed to do, yeah? But do we even have materials to make something? A crafting table. You can create items here. I guess we can investigate for now. We'll get a timey. We need the correct materials to craft something. What can we make right now? Nothing. Okay, so... Oh, a joy! It was a negative timey I got. And now we gotta do something with it, though. Um, 
That's a big stick of imitation crab. It must be a vending machine. Oh, Jesus, both sucks. Um, well, hold off. I need something with less time. Iris's live stream is showing on the monitor. That is really bad. Nope. Oh man, I don't think I'm I'm gonna take a huge hit. It is blocked, but this must. Yeah. All right. So, we'll just go ahead and investigate the vending machine. Maybe give him some materials out of it. Well, it is definitely not imitation crab. Hey, Iba. Yes. I wonder why the people who made this game called it Shovel Forge. Perhaps they are interested in crafting digging utensils. I see. It's a strange world out there. Uh, see, when I thought about investigating, I thought, like, legit, they were going to, a vending machine. like, push something, whatever. I, like, do we dig it up? That seems weird. Happy digging. Roger. There you go. I got a lot of materials that time. Good haul today. Be sure to like and subscribe and to read to it, everyone. Hey, Iba. Yes? Is this golden Yokocho? Indeed. It appears to be modified, but it probably is based on golden Yokocho. This is where we were attacked. Look, Dante! What is that? Uh-oh, an elite is coming. But it's okay. I've got the feeling we can do it! Project Bluebeam! Nice is trying to kill me! You have to stop Nice! But what are we supposed to do? Dance! Dance? Use the most beautiful art form humanity has ever created! The power of dance! They may have money and power, but they'll never take our beating hearts! Dance is the only way to fight the Wadjet system in Nice! Using this material, we can make a disco ball! Let's build the disco ball! And then it's dancing time! What do you think, Iba? Shovel Forge is not a dancing game, but... That's not what I'm talking about. Nyes does not exist. But I don't think Iris is trying to mislead me. What you think does not change the facts. Now, we have to decide our next move. For now, we need to find somewhere to craft the disco ball. I don't know what to believe anymore, to be quite honest with you guys. other than disco balls. Well, we need to make the disco ball now. That's what the viewers are expecting. Right? Why would we want to make something else? Oh, man, I don't know, guys. Understood. That's yeah. anything but a ball, though. But it is Minecraft. I mean, Shovel Forge, so... Mm. That was anticlimactic. What should I do? Dance, Dante! Fight against Nyes with the power of dance! Iba, dance. You have to dance. Okay, if I must. Oh. Yeah, go Iba! You're doing it, I think. It's the same dance animation, but... Okay. My brain is all over the place right now, guys. I were, were they on drugs when they played this game, or when they made this game? Um, that's they're attacking. Iba? Oh, okay. I... I... I don't... I'm wondering how what you guys are thinking right now, because... 
I, I just don't know what to think myself. We did it. Yay! We foiled Project Bluebeam! Amazing, Dante! We can fight nice for sure! I'm not afraid of them as long as you're here. Yeah. Good. Huh? Well, I don't know how, but we defeated that big guy! Oh, a rare drop! Awesome! Let's see how far we can get today. Let's go, everyone! Onward! Please defeat Nice. I know you can do it, Date. All right, let's go, Iva. A hot head is not what we need in this situation. It makes me wonder what would have happened if we actually made something else instead of Disco Ball. Uh, did we pick up the rare? Yeah, we did. So, let's move forward. This appears to be another gate, but something is blocking it. What's blocking it? You have a better axe. Dig through it. Do it. Leave it to me. There we go. I dug it up. Got the material. Let's move on. I'm worried about that last this choice, is a though. Spacious area. Is that marble? Those flowers are winter irises. They're wilted. Wow, this place is huge! How are we gonna check everything? Maybe I can make something with the materials I have. Okay? Okay! Another crafting table. At least you don't have to do any more digging. Dante, do you see that shrine? Shrine? That's humanity's last hope against nice. Save us from the oppression of technology. Return the stone monument to the pedestal at the shrine. We should have all the materials we need to craft the stone monument. Please, Date. You're the only one who can save me. You're the only one who can save this world. Only me? Date. I'm the only one who can save her. Hey, Date. What? Is following Iris's plan really the best idea? I don't know, but I feel like we're getting closer to the truth. Really? Let's go with it a little longer. I suppose we can. I will follow along for now. I mean, honestly, I'm worried that following her may not be the best, but I don't... I'm... But you know what? We have the better axe. I can get out of here. I can go back to the gate one, yeah? I, I just... I have to try, guys. That... Where the hell did I just go? That's gate four. I mean, as I break all the way through. Oh, you know what? Just screw it. Like, let's follow what the game wants us to do right now. Crafting table. That's the pedestal. Okay. There's a crafting table here as well. Let's. Oof. Sixty seconds. Let's hope that I get a good timing for the investigation. The same crafting table we've used previously. Oh, thank God. Okay, so a little bit of strategy there. We used 30 seconds to get, instead of 60, to get the crafting monument. So, save a little bit of time. Iris said that all the materials should be here, but... What's that on the floor next to the table? This is the egg that came out of the vending machine earlier. An egg! We can use this! Okay, build the monument with that. There you have it, Iva. Understood. Done. You could have given it a little more oomph. Specifications for oomph not found. Please take the monument to the shrine. You can make miracles, Dante. Got it. Leave it to me, Iris. Are you going to continue doing whatever Iris tells you? Iba, I get where you're coming from, but I want to believe her. I see. If that is what you believe, then I will obey. I exist to support you, Dante. Let's bring this to the shrine. Yeah, let's go. I just don't know what to believe anymore, honestly. This appears to be a pedestal. I guess place it. 
Understood. It will be done. The wilted irises blossom. What? There were dead flowers outside. What happened to them? I assume they blossomed as well. Yep. What? There's something around the flowers. Another rare drop? I suppose we dig here. Right. Yeah, why does it look like it's in shape of a heart? Well, I, I guess we dig in there. The color of this floor is slightly different. Let's dig. All right, try digging. Understood. Space! Took a little bit longer. All right. Love? This. I've never seen anything like this before. Is it on the wiki? I'm gonna go check. Give me a second. What is this? Oh, I get it. It's a love bomb. Hmm? An item of that description is not in the game. Let's fight for the future with the power of love. If you use this, you might be able to find me. Use it? How? You need to dance, Date! Oh, that's right! Again? Haven't I danced enough already? This is to save Iris. Please, just bear with it for now. Alright. I'll just use this bomb somewhere over there, I suppose? Yeah, try it. I guess? I don't know. Wait. All the way over there? Wait a minute, what the hell's that question mark? Oh, wait, what is that? Hold on, what is this? Is this not Falco? Someone's there? Oh, but look at the time. Damn it, God. Oh, did I talk? Excuse me, who are you? I meant to click exit. Well, there you go, 60 seconds. Hey, don't say that about Mama. Oh, please. Is that... this man? What? You know him? Not exactly. He is a familiar face that has appeared in many unrelated people's dreams. He is an urban legend of sorts. If you are interested, I can tell you more later. No, that's okay. The hell? You're a material? Is that the spatial... Temporal man? I don't know if what I did was correct. I wasted a lot of time there, but oh man. We cannot move forward with the debris in the way. I am not gonna have a lot of time. I'm gonna hope to investigate. I hope I lose time. Something is clearly peculiar about this debris. Or not lose time, but you guys get what I mean. Like, don't have to use as much. It's blocking the gate, but it seems to have come from nowhere. It's unnatural, for sure. Does that mean Iris is blocking us on purpose? Can she do that? What if this is also part of Iris' imagination? Okay, thank God. We can... Let's, uh... Let's use the love bomb. Around here? Yeah. Dance, baby, dance! Do you want me to dance? Please. More dancing, I suppose. What? Oops. Looks like I messed that up, didn't I? Okay, well, guess I'll just die and restart. What?
this place. Okay, let's regroup and keep going. As a video game character, experiencing death again and again is wearing me down. Iris is further away from us now. So when will you stop believing her? Dante, can you see that shrine? Iris, I'm sorry. Did we make a mistake? No, you haven't. What's going on? Are we supposed to go that direction? Iris? Are you there? Something big is coming. Okay, this guy's gonna be the final boss for today. No, stop! Stay away! Iris! Nice is coming! Dante, help me! Huh? Sorry, everyone. My PC is actually weird. Iris is in trouble. Is there any way to save her? Date, this is Somnium. It cannot affect the real world. That's not true. I saved Iris in Somnium once. If I don't save Iris here, Iris in the real world is in danger. Either way, we do not have the power to fight against the UFO. If you want to help Iris, we need to find a way. What can we do? Where do we go? I don't know, but I'm running out of time. Mirror door, another gate. I thought I can dig through the pyramid. It's a pyramid. Should I try digging? Oh, damn it, I don't have a lot of time. Let's dig, I guess. We no longer have a pickaxe. I didn't realize. Oh, fudge. Right. I don't know why I thought I'd just waste some more time. That was just mirror door, though. A mirror door. Reflected in it. Dance? What? Power of dance. The most beautiful thing humanity has ever created. Dance is the only way to beat Nyes in the Wadjet system. The reason why your reflection isn't shown in the mirror is because of Nyes. You're a threat to their existence. They're trying to erase you and. Date. Please do it. Understood. I'll do it. I mean, the love bomb didn't go our way, but maybe now it'll be okay? Uh, I, I just don't know. Like, I am so confused about all of this right now. The story just took a weird-ass turn this whole video. But then, you look back at the Zeroscape games. They kind of do the same thing, yeah? It's like, it seems to be going normally, then like, later on, it's like, what the fudge? And then it becomes normal. So maybe it's exactly what is happening here. Oh, well, now they're dancing. The thing is, I'm still not going to have a lot of time. I still need to destroy uh, the fourth block. Home. I, I, I don't know. I don't think I've been this loss of words in a very long time. When it comes to a video game, I can only imagine if somebody was playing this while they're high, like I'm shrooms or something. Probably freaking out so bad right now. It's thank you for finding me, Date. Iris. Is it really you, Iris? Okay, so now we have a choice. I don't know how this is gonna work, but the hell? Both say release Iris. What the hell is that? It oh, fudge. I don't know, guys. Believe me. There was no way I was ever going to win this. Touch core, I guess.
Iba, touch the core. Date. This doesn't look good, guys. I'm getting a bad feeling about all this. For all we know, we probably just released a damn virus. Okay, well that went down the left path. How the hell did we go down the right path? I believe Iris. So, oh, I, I still got an achievement for that. So, maybe, maybe depending on what happened earlier, like digging through something or like digging through the first gate after we got the bigger, the better axe, um, not making the disco ball. I wonder if that would. May just go down the right path after defeating Nyes? I, I don't know. I don't know. I'm not going to get an answer right now. I'm so damn confused. But we beat it in one go. So that's, that's yay. I guess. Um. I need to stop the video, though. That's for damn sure. When we get a break, I'll, I'll stop. You know what? I'll, I'm there. I'll just stop it right here because I'm my damn head. But let's see what we got. We got yeah, all this of Algorg is a enormous multinational corporation headquartered in California. Specializes in uh, internet related services, such as online advertisement technology, search engines, cloud computing, software, um, even hardware. Past ten years, they've been developing spacefaring technology and rockets. Okay, now. A geostationary satellite. Um, all that. Space advocacy, advocacy group. Where people, they said that's where they discovered X00639. The man-made satellite, apparently. Um, okay. Yeah, so... I'm gonna stop the video here. I gotta process everything I just... You know... Experienced. And next time, we will see where the fudge this game decides to take us. And I don't know how the hell we're going to go down the right path, but I'll figure that out later. So, as usual, thank you all so much for watching. And I'll see you all next time for Let's Play I, The Somnium Files. Love you all so much. Have a great day. Thank you all for watching this video. If you enjoyed what you saw, feel free to leave a comment, a like, and subscribe for future content, where I aim to release a video a day. And if you do subscribe, make sure to click on the bell symbol to be notified once new videos are uploaded. You can also catch me streaming from time to time on Twitch, follow me on Twitter, and join my Discord server to relax with other gamers. All this information is in the description box below. Have a great day.